What's up guys, Econ John here. In this video, we're gonna talk about the proof for consistency of the OLS estimator. Let's go. So what is a consistent estimator? Recall that for an arbitrary linear model of the form y is equal to x beta plus epsilon, which is an error term, an estimator is said to be consistent if the probability limit of it converges to its true value beta, as in beta without a hat, right? Meaning that it's not an estimator. OLS is said to be consistent, but how do we know for sure? So the proof that the OLS estimator is consistent is, recall that the OLS estimator is defined as the following. Beta hat is equal to x transpose x inverse times x transpose y. Knowing that our linear model is of the form y is equal to x times beta plus epsilon, which is our error term, we sub that into our estimate for our beta hat. We go and we get x transpose x inverse times x transpose times x times beta plus epsilon. Right? This reduces down to beta hat is equal to beta plus x transpose x inverse times x transpose as epsilon. So now let's divide both sides by our sample size n. Right? We go and get the following expression. Taking the probability of limit of both sides and recalling the fact that the p limb of x transpose epsilon over n is equal to zero, we get our p limb of beta hat is equal to beta, which is our true parameter. So this is the proof that the OLS estimator is consistent. Let me know what you thought, and I hope this video helps. Take care.